Okay, good morning everyone. It is currently Monday. Does this look bad? We are not sure. Okay, so it's Monday morning um, during the vacances, which is the break. So I thought it would be a great time to take some exercise classes this week. And so I'm gonna be taking you guys through um, just the different classes I take. Some of them are gonna be on class pass. Some of them I'm just gonna take like by themselves. Um, but basically I wanted to take you through this because I know for some people like taking an exercise class can definitely be scary. I know for me, um, the French aspect makes me the most scared. I'm like, what if I don't understand? What if I like, can't follow because it's too fast? But so this morning I'm starting out with a yoga class at huge, huge. I imagine it's like pronounced like Donald Trump says huge. Ha ha. Um, okay, so I'm taking a yoga class with them and I'm actually really excited. I think it's gonna be cool. I hope it's good. Um, so it's it's 30 euros a class. So I'm doing this one on class pass. If you never use class pass, I'm literally a class pass stan. Um, you like pay for credits and you can use it at different studios. And this one was 11 credits, so that's pretty expensive. Um, but I yeah, I'm excited to try it out. I'm gonna be doing a gentle flow class, which I think will be great. And the studio, I hope you can see it. It kind of looks like this. So I'm going to the one in the first. Looks like this, definitely very, you know, vibey yoga. Um, so I'm really excited, but let's, you know, let's get to it and I will let you guys know how it goes after. Okay guys, we have made it back successfully. I'm alive, I'm well, I made it. Um, what should I say? Oh, okay, so the class, the class, the class. Okay, I like loved the class, like I really did. I thought the teacher was wonderful, she was so nice. Um, it's like kind of weird when you walk in, you're like in the yoga space, which is kind of different. So she, you walk in, you're like, oh, like there's no front desk or anything. And um, there's like really nice locker rooms, all of that. And it was cool. She it was funny. She was like she was talking and she was like, guys, like I might not know how to say some things in French, so like I'll probably just say it in English. And I was like, I was like, same year, like me too, like we're in the same boat. But it was a really great class, like a great like, um, kind of like a beginner class. Just like just like, long story short, it was a great class. The studio was beautiful. My only gripe, my only gripe was that the mats smelled. so so bad. I mean, like, like, and I noticed when we were, okay, so the mats were kind of like, they almost felt like a, like a yoga towel where they were kind of like fabric -y. And I noticed that afterwards when people were cleaning them, they just wiped them off and then they immediately roll them back up and then put them back in the shelves, which is like not really sanitary. So I would say maybe like bring your own mat um, if you want to go there. So I went to Yuge. In the first, near the Louvre, and I went to the Gentle Flow yoga class, and my teacher was awesome. Um, if I was going to give it out of five stars, I would give it five stars. Ten out of ten would go again. So I will see you guys at my next class. Okay, hello. Happy Tuesday. Um, this is probably a really weird angle, but so yeah. Um, today I'm going to be taking a bar class at 12.30, so I need to leave here in about 30 minutes. And I'm going to be going to Bar Shape. Um, the class I went to yesterday also, I forgot to mention, it was near Châtelet, so super centrally located. This one is also near Châtelet. Um, and there's a couple different state. Did I already say where I'm going? I'm going to, yeah, I'm going to a bar class at Bar Shape. And I'm really excited. Bar classes, like, really kick my ass. So that should be good. Um... I've actually been here before, so I want to disclose that. I have, but I didn't take a bar class. I took like a, like a dance. It was literally so fun. It was like a Zumba, like a weighted like Zumba class. And it was so fun. And the people were really nice here. So um, that makes me feel like a little bit, obviously ne less nervous. I will say I am nervous for the class just because um, it's bar, like specifically this type of bar, I think is a little bit more fast paced. So I think the French might be a little bit harder for me. Um, but, you know, I'm excited. We'll see. I think this is, um, yesterday put me in such high spirits after that class. So I'm excited to keep it rolling. And I will see you guys after the class. Hopefully I can get more like B-roll of the studio. Yesterday it was like so dark in there and there was people. So hopefully I'll get more shots today.
I thought maybe also while I'm sitting here waiting to go to the bar class, I would just interject something. Um, so in the US, I used to take a lot of classes. I used to do um, class pass, which I've talked about before. And I don't know, I just like, I feel like I definitely miss that feeling of like going to a studio, like knowing the teacher, um, going to classes with your friends. So hopefully this week I'll like maybe find something that I can um, start doing regularly and try to kind of like find that community that you usually find when you go to the same studio. The only issue is the prices here in Paris are just like kind of crazy. Like I couldn't pay to just like drop in for 30 euros twice a week. Um, but I just thought I would like interject that really fast and I'm really excited to go to this bar class today. Also, looking at, um, so this is the one I'm going to for bar shapes. Like I said, I've been there before, it's so beautiful. But look at these other studios. That's the one at Opera, Trocadero. Like, it looks so beautiful. So I'm excited, I wanna try out these other places maybe sometime. <laughs> Okay, so yesterday I ended up going to lunch with my friend Hannah and then we went to Kira's so I didn't have time to like do the rundown of um, there's an AirPod. Khalil's AirPods are in my sh shot. Um, okay, so I didn't have time to like do like the rundown of what happened yesterday, but oh my god. Okay, so yesterday the bar class. Literally, it was like, so it was a great class. It was so hard though. Um, I It was taught by this like beautiful like probably like a ballerina girl. And that's another thing is I feel like the bar classes here are a lot more like actually ballet inspired. Like we were doing like, like, you know, like this kind of like stuff and oh my gosh. The other thing, okay also, the studio, beautiful, the people, so nice, it was amazing. The other thing is too though, during the class, like I could not understand anything. Like there was like music, they were talking, she was talking so fast and like, but you can you can keep in rhythm. Obviously, you can like watch what other people are doing. So like, don't let that intimidate you. Um, but it was a lot like, and we set six like, sank you know la la la. Like so you can definitely keep in rhythm. Um, I could understand so much better during the yoga class. But so overall, like it was so great. Like I would totally go back there again. I'm like so sore in my abs today and like my arms. Um, but moving on. Okay, so today is Wednesday. I can't remember if I said that, but we're gonna be taking a class today at Dynamo, um, Dynamo Cycling, which I've heard Dynamo is kind of like equivalent to maybe kind of like the Soul Cycle of Paris, um, kind of like a little culty, or no, maybe not culty, but it's just like popular. It's nice. I heard some celebs go there. I'm gonna cut that out. Um, it is pricey. I, I bought a package online that said it was 15 for like a discovery class. I have no idea if it worked. Um, I like I, um, like signed up online for my class. It says you need to get there 20 minutes early, so I'm gonna go ahead and do that. Um, I'll try to obviously once again take some video of the studio, but I get so awkward. Also, in like the locker rooms at the places in Paris, people are like legit like naked. Like people don't just like put their shit in there and then go to the class. like. People like literally like get like fully undressed, so can't really film in there. Um, but I'm actually really excited to try this class. I've done cycling before in the U.S. and I'm excited to see what this one's like. So and without further ado, I should probably get going. So I will see you guys after the class. Oh my God, you guys. <laughs> Okay, so I am back from the class. <laughs> ah, okay, like where to even begin? Okay, so walked in and I was like, hi, it's my first time. And they were very like, yeah, yeah sure, like fast, fast. And they took me to the locker rooms and showed me how to use the locker. And they're like, okay, bye. And they gave me shoes. You get you get shoes there um, to like stick into the, the bike. Um, and so then when I went into the like cycling room and also 
I would definitely say of all of the three classes I've taken this week, this environment was the most like intimidating. Just like a lot of like really fit people there and they like a lot, there was a lot of like groups of friends there and good to everyone like kind of knew each other. So I definitely think it has kind of like the same um, vibe as Soul Cycle. It's very like, like a cult workout where like you can tell a lot of people like go there a lot and like they all know each other. But anywho, like no big deal. I went to the cycling room and the same woman who checked me in, I asked her if she could help me um, like clip in and like get my bike adjusted. And so she did that and that was super nice. And she showed me um, the different like hand positions, the class. <laughs> so the class starts and I was feeling like this weird sense of like anxiety because I was like, I don't know like what the lights are gonna be like. It just like, it feels like anticipation. You're like, what's gonna happen? And everyone's like warming up. Everyone's like on their bike, like pedaling. And you're like, oh my God, look at them like warming up, like whatever. But, like nothing wrong with that, but they're like, you know, like getting into it, like, you know, whatever. And so then the class starts and the lights like go out. And first of all, they start like blinking this light. And I was like, I was like, I do not want to have that in my face the entire class. Like, it was like, like a flash in your eyes, but they only did it like every so often. I don't know, it was weird. But anyways, so the class starts and the music was great. The music was great, I will say. And I cannot understand a single word that she's saying. Like, like literally no. I mean, she's like, I could understand like, Ale, on y va, like, Tous, like resistance, like blah, blah, blah. I can understand that, but I, it was like something about the mic, like the way that like her voice was distorted with the mic. I was like, I can't understand anything. So basically, I was I was just like pedaling the whole class. Like sometimes I would go faster. I was like looking at people around me. Sometimes I would go slow because people around me were going slow, and like I had no idea what I was doing with my arms, and I had like no rhythm with like pedaling fast and like going like this. <laughs> It was definitely a rough, uh, like it wasn't rough, but I was like, I just like had no idea like what I was doing. Could not understand anything she was saying. Um, tried to follow along though. And like, I, I didn't turn the resistance like at all. Cause I was like, I have no idea what's going on. And um, yeah, so that was that. But ultimately I'm trying to think of anything else. Oh, a lot of people in the class were like, woo, like, yeah, woo, like at different points. And I was like, okay, like, yeah, like go off, um, whatever. So I did that and ultimately I would say like, like it went by really fast, mostly cause I, the whole time I was just like pedaling, what's going on, what's going on, like what do I do, like da da And then after, and then you also do like a little like arm session during, I had like, like super light weights. We were doing like some arm stuff like without pedaling your feet. So that was kind of cool. That really burned my arm. So that was a nice little like um, bonus. So then after they were like, oh, there's three minutes left and we were kind of doing some like stretching and people like were like rushing out of the room and I was like, wait, what's going on? Like, are we done? But no, it's like those people are like rushing because there's only like three showers and people like actually shower. I would assume, so this was a 12, 15 class. So I would assume a lot of people are coming on their lunch and it's only 45 minutes long. So that's also good. So people are like running to the showers. Um, so then I had I couldn't figure out how to get my like, my feet, my shoes out of the clips. And I was like, I don't know what to do. Um, so I had to ask someone to help me, like just another girl in the class. Um, so, and then I, so I put all my stuff in the room with the showers, which I would not see. I like didn't, I don't know why I did that. Like, okay, so there's a hallway with like just regular lockers. And then there's also like the shower room with lockers. I would suggest like, just, just, if you're not gonna shower, leave your stuff in the outside ones because afterwards, the shower area was like packed with people showering. I, I assumed to go back to work. So ultimately, I mean, I just like don't, like would I go again? Like maybe, um, I did like sweat a little bit. Like, you know, I think it's a pretty good, like, I mean, everyone there was like so fit. So I was like, wow, this must be doing something right. Um, but like, I don't know, I, I didn't enjoy it as much as the other classes, I think. Well, I mean, it was like hilarious. I wish I had a video of me being like, I think my, my face was probably just like so confused the whole time. I was like, I have no idea what's going on. But would I do it again? Sure. But like, I just, I feel like it's just like a personal preference. Like I just like don't like love spin classes. Like if I wanted to do cardio, I would probably just like go on a run. I like, I like running and it's not confusing. Um, so I would give that like, 
it's nothing like it was a super nice studio it was, i mean the stuff she was saying i'm it sounded like it was super motivational she was like say i can't even i i can't even like repeat what she said but it sounded like she was really you know motivating everyone like good for her and she was had a great present she had great presence the music was great so it's like nothing against like the class of the studio it's more like my own personal preference um i would give it like a three out of five just because i like just like didn't enjoy it as much it did go by really fast though so i feel like that is a good sign i don't know should i give it a five out of five i don't know just take what you want from my words but that was like quite an experience so i hope that i gave you some good information and i will see you guys at the next class okay greetings all so as the last part of the video said i was gonna do more classes but i thought i would just leave it at an even three um bar or yoga bar cycling um so thanks for watching and i hope you guys found this informational and i will see you in the next video